Good morning from Medjugorje on this August 25th, 2024. We're going to have another hot day, 38 degrees Celsius. 90 degrees Celsius low, then we have 20 degrees Celsius at now 18. And the temperatures will drop a little bit to 36, 35, 36, 34, 33 the next few days but still quite hot over the 30s. And let's go into town and discover what's going on on this beautiful Sunday morning. I like this time of the day, it's still quiet. You are the people working in the kitchen of um, Hotel Sulic. And for all my Irish friend, remember, friends, remember 11th to 14th of September 2024 walked across an island from the far corners of Ireland. There's a pilgrimage to the center with beautiful priests, confession, community walking together and you can get information and subscribe for the walk. The email is walkedacross33 at gmail.com. Again, walkedacross33 at gmail.com. Take part, pray for Ireland, pray for peace in the world, pray for Europe, and let's continue the tour. And again, if you like the video, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell button for notifications, and give a like, and leave comments, more likes, more comments. The videos go up, and we evangelize together. Please write from where you're watching. That's for me very, very interesting. Also, your prayer requests and intentions. And if you have suggestions, and look, there is Cross Mountain behind the school. And still now the temperatures is okay to take you on this Sunday morning walk here. This peaceful morning as you can see. This shop here seems to be open already as well. Well, look what you can have. Ice cream, iced coffee, coffee to go, fresh orange juice, fruits. That's nice. Look at this beautiful dress. That's so beautiful here. The women, if you see in summer, they have long dresses, no tattoos, very decently dressed, rising to the occasion as it is a saintly place here. And I recommend when you come here, when you go to the church, cover yourself, long dresses, just covered as it was before, you know. Even I have long pants on, I have a polo shirt on. Because this is not an amusement park here, this is a holy place. This is the Catholic Church, there's Holy Mass. There are priests, there are nuns. And it's a holy, just a holy place where you can get hold meaning get healed. 
that's what happened to me the last you say all the time I've been in Metrigoy it's a place of healing if you open your heart you receive it's a place of graces but you need to open your heart and what helps the five stones confession daily rosary prayer from the heart daily bible reading holy mass and fasting that's for me still a bit tough I guess for all of you but it's very effective And I have honestly to say, you see the difference how people from here dress and how people dress coming from Western Europe. It's a totally different education. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? And please pray for the tour guides. They do a tremendous, tremendous job here in Metzogoy. To take the people around. Right here passing the bakery right now here. And you have Burrito, the ice cream shop of Burrito slowly opening again, step by step. And let's see a bit what's going on on the main road here in Metzogoy. You have the best, best ice cream in town. And let's turn back towards St. James Church. This restaurant tomato. And it seems the fast local mass just finished it seems like there are three Croatian masses in the morning by the way here you have all the prizes you make a stop and you see the prizes one direction to split 150 euro 240 back and forth 150 to Dubrovnik 240 back and forth 150 to Sarajevo 240 back and forth Makaska 100 150 back and forth 40 euros to uh, Mostar back and forth 60 20 to Kavitz of 40 euros back and forth to the waterfalls. And you see, it's a peaceful morning here in Metrigoy. Wow, this is fantastic, man! Wow! 
<laughs> oh, nice, man. Have a good Sunday, yeah? So, look at that, the motorbike. It's fantastic, man. Fantastic, man. I think it's So many people here in Mexico this morning. So we have three local masses in the church and in the back altar in the morning. So the the international masses they are at the Saint Saint John Paul the Second Hall, the yellow hall in the back, next to the back altar in the back. Wow! Look at that, man. <laughs> Fantastic. Get this motorbike. There he is again. Fantastic. Look at the motorbike. Good morning, Joseph. Good morning. <laughs> Joseph, the taxi driver. And you see, Restaurant Dubrovnik. You can sit in the shadow over there. That's nice. And look on the church towers. And here we are at the same thing, church. I see a lot of people already at nine o'clock. And our lady, beautiful as always, over here. And let's entrust our day to her and we pray, Jesus, take my hand, our lady, take my hand, and guide me every second of this beautiful Sunday in the divine will through the guidance of the Holy Spirit. And we take refuge in her immaculate heart in the, and in the precious heart of Jesus. And we cover us in the precious blood of Jesus Christ in that spiritual combat that is going on right now. We pray for the peace in the Middle East. There was a big preemptive attack from um, self-defense attack from Israel in the southern part of Lebanon. They were, uh, uh, Hezbollah wanted to like, launch rockets at Tel Aviv and as it's written in the Catechism of the Catholic Church, every country has the right for self-defense. And but, but what we do, we pray for the peace in the Middle East, in Israel, in all the Arabic countries, that they find the beauty of the teaching of Christ, that they find, find Jesus Christ. It said that when the Arabic people, they are very fervent people, when they find Christ, they are one of the most who are going to adore and, and worship him. There's a lot of fervor. <laughs> And we invoke St. Michael, the Archangel, to defend us in the battle. And we thank for our guardian angel. We ask for protection for this day, for us, for our loved ones, our families, our countries, and the whole world. And we pray this in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. 
Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for our sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. And again we pray in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. We surrender all our problems, all our challenges, financial problems, worries, mental health issues. Surrender everything into the hand of Our Lady and to Jesus. It's written Exodus, I think, 14, 14. I am God, be still, I fight for you. We pray for faith and to listen to the promptings of the Holy Spirit that we are guided in the divine will. And then we are in the secure place. God says when we love, we are secured, we are sealed, and love also covers a lot of sins. So we pray that again in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And let's continue our tour. Seems like an Ukrainian group we just saw. And let's walk a bit down the main road of Mechigan. You see, it's full, a lot of people. Sunday morning, 25th of August 2024 in Medjugorje. And if you like to do a donation to my ministry to show the beauty of Medjugorje and of the Catholic faith, you find the way to do it in the description of the video. I also wrote a book about walking in the Holy Spirit. You find the book in the description of the video as well. <laughs> We have the museum over there. Let's have a quick look what's going on over there at the museum. It's good to be in the shadow. But you see there are more local people at the museum. Some pilgrims as well. in the morning here in the shadow people are as the sun is already quite strong and remember the hand of God is just fingertips away you just open your heart and say God the Father show me that you love me that you exist that you are interested in my life and he will appear he will make himself known to you that's written in the Bible the one who seeks me I will reveal myself to him not complicated our faith is childlike, simple, not childish, but childlike, simple. And we have over there as well people on the terrace. And let's go it means in between the mountains. You see also on this side the mountains, cross mountain behind the church. That's amazing. You can see the cross now between the towers. have a nice coffee in the morning as well Sunday morning to celebrate it the day of the Lord Holy Mass remember that's the high prayer of our faith Holy Mass and receive in the Eucharist truly body and blood of Christ be well be well prepared well confessed in the state of grace and receive Christ reverently I suggest always in the mouth kneeling it's the king of the world when you meet the king, a king you kneel and you show reference and you go properly dressed to the church long trousers, long like, like long dress covered the private parts are private and they should be covered that is what I it's just a recommendation but it's also written at the church now there are big signs please reverently dressed come to the church and you 
see Cafe Chiara is closed. It seems still. But it's Sunday. And we are going to turn around here. Some people over there. The Cafe Chiara is still closed. And I'm turning around here going back across to the charts so we are coming to the end of this walking tour thank you for watching have a beautiful joyful sunday wherever you are around the world and please pray for me my family my dad as i pray for you and your family yeah, from the heart to the heart God bless you all and we walk a little bit further towards the church. And I just saw a video from winter. It's amazing in winter. It's raining. It's dark. Not many people. And you see the difference the summer. So God bless you all from Medjugorje.